My opinion is Little Dynamite. My name is Little Dynamite. I'm coming to prove that I deserve that female midget belt. Beautiful Bobby Joe will not be looking so beautiful anymore. So after I kick her ass, I want the belt. Let's go, babies. You're eating popcorn now on set? Oh, how'd you get popcorn? Yeah, I well, we're, we're I announcing there's a fight. We're gonna show respect. Just, I, this is Jaws of Little entrance. Dynamite Park. There's an entrance. She calls a student, says she's ready to explode, not into trash talk. She's fighting Jersey Jerry's girl, beautiful Bobby Joe Tolkien. Why do you keep saying it's my girl? Because in the locker room, you, you were ranting raving. She said she was hot, right? No, I said she's an attractive little girl. Same thing. Yeah, I mean, that's not, I'm, you, not, I'm you, not saying she's hot. Said she was your girl. It's a synonym. I said she's my girl because she, she fights good at Rough and Rowdy. I've watched her every fight. Beautiful yeah. Bobby so Joe. Up. And in the ring right now, we've got Large, the only Barstool employee licensed to ref in the beautiful Legalized state of West Virginia. Ref. Let's see if beautiful Bobby Joe can keep it going for the Tolley family. We saw her brother, the Heartbreaker, before get a win, an awesome win, a comeback win. In, in, in all the years of doing, this is rough around 21, first time we've had a, a broadcaster eating popcorn during the telecast. That it's is good Jersey popcorn. Jerry. I know you like popcorn. It's pretty good. It's good. I do love popcorn. Very all good. right, here we go. Let's see if it can be a clean sweep for the Tophies. Her brother already won in impressive fashion. I tell you that uh, beautiful Bobby is quite a bit bigger than her opponent here. Yeah. This could be quick work. This is going to be very quick. First you, round. Punches and bunches. Oh, good shot. And uh, her opponent, Blue, is not She's doing anything. There. She's kind of trying to swat and now run away. Beautiful Joe. Hunting her down in the ring. Oh, this, she I don't, is. This I, is just. Yeah, I don't. I don't this know. Is predator this, and prey. Yeah, it's like a lion and a gazelle, Robbie. Oh, not little man. jab. I don't know if Jocelyn has a chance in this fight. No, she has a good scowl though. What does that mean? Like the, the look face, on her face. Like, oh, okay, gotcha, gotcha. Yeah. Oh, That's a big shot. Oh, Folded after eight. head back. Standing eight. <laughs> large gives. Uh, Jocelyn, a little dynamite, a standing eight. Large really does look large in here. Yeah. Well, there's a couple things working in his favor that make him maybe seem bigger than he actually is. Like what? Well, he's a tall and... The shoes? The, w the women in the ring are little people. Oh, fuck, I didn't even notice. Oh, just putting that together. Cherry Bomb in the corner of beautiful Bobby. Oh, we got a, uh, a Playboy bunny making her way into the ring. And then a beer cart girl. And, and I got good news for you, Dave. Yeah. The Barstool Sportsbook is now offering a $1,000 bonus for new players. If your first bet loses, get up to $1,000 in bonus cash. So download and create an account today. Use code TAKE to unlock your $1,000 bonus. Be sure to use the word TAKE to unlock your $1,000 bonus. Terms apply, must be 21 plus. Gambling problem, call 1-800-GAMBLER. Question for you on the same topic, Dave. I was thinking about this the other day. When you place your big bets, your 100K, 200K bets, do you ever in the moment sit there as you're placing the bet and think, Robbie could use this money? No. Just wonder. What about Jerry? Nope. I okay. d I, I, what I'm worried about is the Heat, minus six and a half. They're up six with a puck 53 to go. That's what I'm thinking uh, about. The Knicks well, to come back there. Round, no, I don't. Round two, I, the, the conclusion is foregone. This is beautiful yeah, Bobby's yeah, fight. This easy fight it's for just, her. Is it going three rounds or not? That's the only question we have left to ponder. Yeah, it feels like it's a matter of when, not if. Little duck move there. I don't know. It's not the most action fight. Feels like a Jersey Jerry promotions fight. No, I, I wouldn't do the promotion for this fight. Why not? This ne fi next fight is my promotion. Okay. And now here comes beautiful Bobby oh, Joe Little. Bad body through. language. Well, she's getting whacked. She's just throwing one punch. She throws that like the, the four back on fist shiver. Oh, nice head right. turn. She Ten throws seconds. the punch like she's trying to hit a speed bat. Yeah, a little bit. Gets her in the corner. Yeah. What, question is, what's next for Bobby Joe? I mean, she's just been coming in rough and rowdy and just winning every time. Yeah, it's sometimes hard, not the easiest thing to find the opponent. This will be three and zero for her with a win yeah. here. Looks like we're gonna get a live ring interview with Large, possibly. Roan? Guys, this is Rough and Rowdy exclusives. 
No one ever touch, talks to the ref in the middle of the round. So what are you seeing in there? You're at a way different plane than these fighters. Absolutely. Every blow is a low blow as far as I'm concerned because I'm so goddamn big. But this girl's got to throw some punches because Bobby Joe's running away with this. Do you think these girls are doing a good job of staying down to earth? <laughs> Very much so, yeah. They're keeping it low, keeping it real. I got to go. He's got to go. All right, round three and what's been all beautiful, Bobby Joe. Looks like the Knicks just grabbed your rebound, up six, bad. I'm going to go 0-2 like I always do. The Red Sox blew a ninth inning lead. Elio told me they never lose. It's tough. How much time left in that game, Knicks missed a three-pointer, 124. Fouls at the end could help you. It's whoever scores next. Round three, I want to show the respect duly earned from both these Warriors. Yes. Touch the Touch gloves, gloves. There. I don't think beautiful Bobby took a punch today. You know, I just don't think Blue has the reach. No. no she also she doesn't. doesn't have the best technique I've ever seen. Although, more That's rapid. a big oh, shot. That turned around. Let's see beautiful Bobby goes for the kill. Oh, man, she really popped her with that. I almost feel like beautiful Bobby's taking it easy on her. She's not charging in when she, like, yeah. she's letting her kind of walk away. Yeah. Beautiful Bobby didn't break a sweat tonight. No. No. Easy fight. Opposite of her brother. Yeah, her brother went through real adversity in that first round. Good night for the Tovies, though. I'm sure they'll I think, be this, I think this is the worst fight of the night This so has far. not been a good fight. It's the worst fight of the Next night. So either far. this or the, uh, or the uh, Jersey Jared promotions fight. I, th I would go with this one. Unless there's Try a knockout. Yeah, Bobby's getting frustrated because she's running away. Yeah, she's looking at large like you want to stop it, but I don't know if you can stop it like that. You know? Yeah. Tough. Not much you can do there. No. Nick's cut it to four. <laughs> Bing bong. God damn it. Oh, and two. Should I take the over in Edmonton? What does Ice have? Yeah, Connor, Connor McDavid. McJesus. All right, we got uh, Caleb with Frank the Tank. Correct, Dave. I'm here with Frank the Tank. Let's set some ground rules. We're at a boxing event. Let's not talk about the Mets. That sounds fair. What are you seeing out here tonight? I'm seeing a lot of knockouts today. Uh, Black Italian Stallion was impressive. Uh, then we had the Cole family, you know, I hear the song, Cats in the Cradles and the Silver Spoon, Little Boy Blue and the Man in the Moon, When you come home, Dad, I don't know when, We'll get together then, My boy lost just like me, He lost just like me. Wow. A little review, I don't even know what we're looking at here in the fight, there wasn't much to look at. What did you that think was about a good this show. last, what did you think about this last fight? Beautiful Bobby Joe is a, is probably the best. Is that your opinion? The best woman's uh, dwarf. Yeah, I, I kind of felt sorry for her opponent. The opponent just didn't, didn't stand a chance. Bobby. You thought her opponent wasn't beautiful? Well, I'm talking about in the ring. <laughs> but you don't, explain. Well, Bobby Joe had the, the best punching power and she was able to square up and make some good land, land some good punches. There should be a, uh, a woman's dwarf title and it should belong to Bobby Joe. Okay, we're gonna go back to the booth. Robbie Fox here, Rough and Rowdy commentator and ringside correspondent. If you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe, new videos every week, and go to watchrnr.com for the latest info on our upcoming events and how to find out how you could be the next fighter in the Rough and Rowdy ring.